Yeah, kind of already went to these crazy cool colleges with all these skills and stuff, but they don't really know where to place me. When I went up there, they did some bad things. Crystal King, you know, did some bad coercion. Come home, I miss you. Come home she's with another man. You know, they say they'd have given me a certificate for every skill they had. Boom, 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 no problem. Here's your diploma, here's this, and everything else. Said Mr. Kirk, for love, left and said, hey, let's do this. And she wasn't there when I got home, but she said, come see me. So, let's help them out. You don't reproduce this in every location you think of something else. But, remember I said I was going to eat people for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? And they thought we were going to tear down their businesses. Well, General Mills cereal. Cornflakes. Because the Indians used to trade corn as signs of peace. And then we made popcorn for good educational movies and morals and stories and ethics. So we start the breakfast with cornflakes. That's why Joseph Kirk liked cornflakes so much with a little bit of sugar. And you go, well, not just businesses that go out and eat. It's families that tell stories. They have lunch together with other families and they meet and they talk about stuff. You know, how was the day? Hey, one time I went on this vacation. One time I heard this crazy story. Let me tell you about it. And then after lunch, you go to dinner. And you go, well, my kids had, you know, General Mills, you know, cornflakes for breakfast. They went to school. They got home. And every once in a while, you know, we don't have a lot of money, but we'll go to the General Mills Steakhouse. Go, oh, wow. General Mills Steakhouse. Look at that. So yeah, you know, it's the kind of stuff that we were teaching our kids growing up. And then we brought our kids down south to Florida. You know, after we gave them drugs to turn their higher functions off, so nobody could spy on the plan that we were doing and get unequal advantage. Because then, that's what started all the arguments between the states. So, that's why Mr. Kirk is driving around to other states making deals not to cut any state out of the plan, but to see what those states that were doing good are doing, tell the other states that weren't doing good, and go back and tell them what they need so that they could put some of the stuff in the other states that weren't doing so great. So when you travel to another state, they can make them feel welcome without having shock. You know, instead of shock therapy, we have a universal healthcare system, tourism, education, and better schools. Oh, the teacher's aid wasn't to take the teacher's job. It was to teach America how to be better teachers.